Not sure that this is recommended, but I just want to test it out. I am 50 something kilo. <laughs> I don't think so that this is recommended. What's up Quicks? So today I'm gonna do my setup for my room. I just moved place guys and I have this room just to build my workspace. I wouldn't say like a gaming setup but I got gaming stuff. Not ready for house tour yet guys because everything is all so messy and I got a cat guys. I got a cat! His name is Turbo. Say hello Turbo. Hello. I got a table from Evis and I got a laptop from Illy Gear. First I'm gonna set up the table. This is the table from Evis. So this is the EV Smart Desk. It's adjustable and it's motorized. Super cool. You can adjust the height to be tall and low so you can actually be standing and you can be seated. This desk is pretty cool with a few features. And there's a feature over here. There is four banks. One, two, three, four for you to save your memory of the setting that you want. So this is how you do it. Hold the memory until it flashes and put it as number one. So this is number one position. If I press one, it will go automatically to your memory. Wow! Then there's even a feature over here which is a wireless charger. You can even, there's a pop-up thingy over here, majiggy. I think you're supposed to screw this. Here, so that you can manage your cables properly and it comes through this brushy little thingy, majiggy. Cable management thingy majiggy. This way it comes out and tada, voila! Cable management. You can adjust this table electronically from 660 millimeters to a height of 1310 millimeters. Pretty cool, huh? This table size is the standard size and there's a lot of sizes that you can choose on your website and it's the walnut color. Show in some arms for the monitors, but I don't have a monitor yet. If you guys can recommend me one, let me know. I want to do a dual setup so that when I do my editing, it's much more wider space. I've always dreamed to have like two monitors for my editing space. So you can adjust the tension for this. Right now, let's check out Ely Gear's computer that they gave me. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey,
computers with something that I don't really know. What we have here is, let me read. I know, I know, you guys are gonna hate on me because they say, You got such a great computer, but you don't know anything about it. You don't deserve it. I'm gonna talk about the things that, what I see outside here, not what uh, in this inside. The inside is this, and you guys should know better because I don't speak this language. These are the insights of what they have on the outside. We have like an awesome keyboard. Look at that. Wait, how do I turn on the keyboard? Okay, that's how I turn on. Yeah, you can change the colors of the keyboard. It's really, really cool. I like this touch. I'm a sucker for all these kind of things. There is a program over here called Illegal Command. You can change the light bar. You can change the lighting of the keyboard. You can change it to rainbow color. You can change it to a single color. See, it even runs. You can even do a wave. Then there's even flashing one. Man, I don't know how people's gonna play games with this flashing one. You, you might get a seizure. There's even the one that follow music, I think. No, I have to play the music. It doesn't... Yeah. It doesn't... That's the operating mode. You can change the performance by going on office mode, game mode, which turns on that super loud fan. Keeps your computer cool. Cool like me. And then you have like the turbo mode. <laughs> The fan is pretty loud, as you can hear. You can change the performance, so I think it will help you save your battery or something like that. Quick button here to change the operating mode, which is cool. So this Elite Gear has gotten ready this command center for you to have easy control of the computer. You can customize all your computers. They don't just sell laptops, they do sell PC and if you guys like know what you want, you can go down to their shop which is at TDDI and also you can go to their website to make your order. If you guys are like computer experts, you know what kind of specs, like I know what I want in my 2J. Everything is customizable, this is the cool thing. So the cool thing about this laptop is if anything gets out of date, you can change it because everything Everything is changeable inside here and what I like about it, it's, it's really lightweight. There's a Thunderbolt port here so if you guys are like from Mac, like I'm from Mac and I use this rugged hard drive and it runs on the type C HDMI port and you got like your LAN cable, you got two USBs, it supports USB 3.1, also you have a micro SD card reader and then there's this one port that says the 10SS. According to the guy, he told me that this is 3.1 but it's BC 1.2 so it supports by charging things and I think it's a pretty cool laptop for me to do my editing because my MacBook Pro is kind of getting slow and the stupidest question I ask is can it support Minecraft? <laughs> there is a built-in webcam under the logo so let me know in the comments below what kind of keyboard or mouse or monitor should I get. Some of y'all are like experts in this kind of stuff so I don't know much about it. I just want to get some minor gaming stuff. Since I have a gaming computer, I should try some games. Let me know games too. Thank you Elidia for helping me out on this. I guess I have to take time to learn because I'm jumping ship from a MacBook to Windows. I know you're gonna be like, why did you jump ship? I'm like, why is Mac so expensive? What are we doing? Quick it up. This is what Turbo did to my chair and my old place before I had a room. Check it out! My chair was perfect condition until Turbo came into my life. But I still love him. He's a cute cat.